We have five companies in phase three clinical trials, and we're right now producing tens of millions of doses. So the fact that you continue to undermine public confidence left a, an empty and hollow plan, but we Thank still you, learn from it. And I, I think Vice the American President people, I'm going to please Thank you, stop President. undermining confidence in the vaccine. Senator Harris, let me ask you the same question that I asked okay. Vice President Pence, which is, have you had a conversation or reached an agreement with Vice President Biden when it comes to the issue of presidential disability? And if not, and if you win the election next month, do you think you should? You have two minutes uninterrupted. So let me tell you, first of all, the day I got the call from Biden, actually is in the call. President Trump nor Vice President Biden has released a sort of detailed health information that had become the modern norm until the 2016 election. Information voters deserve. Vice President Trump's the nomination. Uh, uh, I, I never expected to be on this stage four years ago, so I know the feeling. But um, the reality is uh, we've got an election. Question I ask, which is, do voters have a right to know more detailed health information about presidential candidates, and especially about presidents, especially when it's based on the Absolutely, and that's why Joe Biden has been so incredibly transparent, especially by contrast on wealthy individuals and corporations. Some economists warn that could curb entrepreneurial ventures that fuel growth and create jobs. Would rates be taxes to the recovery at risk? The tariffs that President Trump put into effect to fight for American jobs and American workers. Joe Biden says democracy is on the ballot. I mean, I thought we saw enough of it in last week's debate, but I think this is supposed to be a debate based on fact and truth. And the truth and the fact is, Joe Biden has been very clear. He will not raise taxes on anybody who makes less than $400,000. Joe Biden said <laughs> twice in the debate last week that he's going to repeal the Trump tax cuts. That was tax cuts that gave the average working family $2,000 in a tax break every single day. That is, Senator, that is absolutely the not true. That is, he only cutting, is he only going to repeal part of the Trump tax break? क्या आप पर भी बर्पा है जाल साजी का कहर? सपने टूटे आपके न घर के न घाट के देखिए लूट घर हर रात साढ़े नौ बजे फिक्र आपकी